Nestled between the Wachung Mountains of northern New Jersey, 28 miles west of New York City, you'll find the Borough of New Providence. This quaint suburb is considered a highly sought after place to live, but it wasn't always called New Providence. The town's history can be traced back to 1664, where due to the abundance of large flocks of wild turkeys, believe it or not, the original name for the area was Turkey. Its first settlers came to the area in 1720 and the Presbyterian Church was the center of life in the small settlement. In 1759, a crowded church balcony collapsed. It was considered a miracle that no one was seriously hurt and soon called a divine act of providence. That's when the name of the town was changed to New Providence Township. Today, the borough is home to about 12,000 residents and is best known for its excellent school system and easy commute to New York City. With its close proximity to nearby Route 78, it's about a half hour drive into the city and an hour away from Pennsylvania. For daily commuters, they have not one, but two train stations. And they're only one stop away from Summit where you can connect to the Midtown Direct train into New York. Route 78 also conveniently connects you to the Garden State Parkway where you're only about an hour away from the Jersey Shore for trips to the beach in the summer. And if you're traveling by airplane, Newark International Airport is only about 15 minutes away. New Providence is a great place to raise a family and the school system consistently ranks in the top 10 schools in New Jersey. Students in the New Providence School District are known for their academic achievements and excellence in athletics. There are two public elementary schools, both of which were given an A plus and rated number 41 and 45 out of the top 100 elementary schools in New Jersey. There is one parochial elementary school and the Morris Union Jointure Commission provides education for children with autism. The high school has approximately 550 students and was placed on the National College Board's District Honor Roll for its AP coursework and high testing scores. New Jersey Monthly Magazine consistently ranks New Providence High School in its top 10, and in 2012, it was ranked number one public high school in the state. Newsweek Magazine also rated the high school as number 68 in the entire nation. The key to most of the success is the involvement of the parents who volunteer to coach, hold fundraisers, and run PTAs, education foundations, and athletic and music booster clubs. The town has an outstanding music program, and in 2015 was awarded Best Community for Music Education by the NAM Foundation. The high school music program travels nationally, and in 2015, the 147 member marching band won both the state and national championships. New Providence has a rich history in athletic success and was voted number 11 in the state, which is remarkable for such a small town. They have several turf athletic fields where sports participation begins at a young age. The Recreation Department runs organized sports programs for youth and adults and children with special needs. The community pool has two Olympic-sized outdoor pools and there are three private swim clubs. The downtown area has many shops with an abundance of free on-street and lot parking. There are plenty of places to eat in town from franchise businesses to varied local restaurants serving choices from Italian to Asian to Mediterranean. There are plenty of nearby cities with even more restaurants to choose from, as well as theaters. And of course, you can always catch a bus or a train into New York City. After dinner, you can burn off the calories at one of the many places to exercise. You have your choice of several health and racket clubs, and in nearby Summit and Berkeley Heights, you'll find the large chain health clubs and YMCAs. There are many sponsored townwide events, which are free to the community. The summertime kicks off with a Memorial Day parade, followed by fireworks for July 4th celebrations, and all summer long, a free concert series plays outdoors in the park. The farmer's market allows local farmers to sell fresh food and produce weekly throughout the summer. In the fall, the town holds an annual street fair, and on Halloween, the town comes alive with trick-or-treaters visiting all the local stores for treats. The day after Thanksgiving, the town holds its annual Christmas walk where Santa arrives and is greeted by a parade. 
There are six houses of worship in town, and New Providence is a diverse community composed of people with a wide variety of faiths, philosophies, backgrounds, and lifestyles. The Diversity Committee of New Providence celebrates diversity in all its forms in the community. New Providence offers many free services to its residents. It has a free public library and free curbside garbage pickup, yearly bulk item pickup, and the town picks up leaves and brush. The fire department and emergency rescue squad are all volunteer and their services are free to the residents. Ask anyone in town and they will tell you it's just overall a friendly town full of generous people and nice families and it's a great place to raise your kids. Two past graduates of New Providence High School even wrote and directed the Hollywood film Win Win which features their hometown in the movie. Between the great town and the great people in it, you could call New Providence a real win-win.